Hello everyone, hope you're doing well. Uh, in today's session, let's discuss how we can create a simple auto trading bot from TradingView to OKX Exchange using their built-in interface. So there are a few exchanges which have done this. Um, they have uh, created a mechanism to generate webhooks and the alert templates um, and this can be used in our uh, trading view uh, scripts, uh, trading view alerts, uh, to generate a signal and send it to the exchanges. And these exchanges will receive these signals and perform the automatic trading or uh, perform the trading uh, based on these signals. So OKX is one such um, uh, you know exchange which has implemented this kind of a feature. And in this example, we'll explore OKX, and also um, in future, I look forward to explore other exchanges, other other um, application which enable this as well. So in order to do this, uh, in order to perform this, like you know, um, you need to have some prerequisites. First is the you need to prepare prepare your trading view account uh, if you have a free account um, you'll not be able to set up webhook integration so you need to have either at least essential plan or repo so so that you can um, set up a webhook um, in order to send uh, signals from trading view to OKX exchange and also you need to enable 2fa integration in your uh, trading view account um, in this example i'm using my other account which is uh, he who must not be named um, and uh, I've already uh, enabled essential plan here and also I've actually um, enabled uh, authenticator app as a 2FA uh, authentication as well. So um, you just need to go to settings, profile settings and enable 2FA if you want to do that. It's simple steps if you can follow um, and also you can refer to uh, trading view help center um, for more on how to do this. Okay, so I've already done this and the next thing is I go to my chart. And then uh, I've loaded a strategy, a simple strategy called RSI strategy. It's a built-in uh, strategy from uh, TradingView. It's a very simple strategy where what it does is um, it will generate a buy signal on uh, um, uh, or, or sold, CO, or sold. And there's a long short, short signal on or, um, or, uh, or bot, right? So it's, it's a very simple strategy. So I'm just using this um, for our demo purposes. <clears throat> okay, so we prep. Uh, so we prepared our trading view account. Next is we need to prepare our OKX account. So if you do not have an OKX account already, uh, go ahead and create them. And um, you know, uh, we prefer you do all your uh, initial experiments in a demo trading account so that you don't uh, you lose real money uh, while experimenting. And once you're sure that this integration is completely set up or um, there is no, um, and you are pretty confident about that, then you can go with the live trading accounts. Okay, so I'm in my demo, demo trading account here. And um, like, you know, what I need to do here is first thing is I need to see, uh, set up um, custom signal, right? So if you go here, um, says create a bot, trading bot, right? So in the demo trading, go to this uh, trading bot. And also uh, in this option, you select the signal bot. Okay, so I already created the signal bot. Uh, I'll just show you how to do it, but I'll not be able to, I'll not use the new one, right? So I'll just create a signal bot, add signal bot. So let's say uh, this is um, demo signal bot, right? It's a demo signal bot um, from trading bot. Okay, so it's not necessarily be trading view strategy. So I'm just creating a webhook here. Like when I create a signal, it doesn't. It means that it creates a webhook for me. So webhook is nothing but a um, server where you can receive your trading view alerts. Okay, so it has given you a webhook URL and also it has given you a message template which can be directly used in your alerts, right? And also there are other types of uh, alerts you can uh, alert templates you can use, which is like entry long exit long entry short and exit short um uh, that if you want if you're not using a strategy interface uh, if you're using a you know um a little bit of complex mechanisms and all you can use this but if you're using a simple strategy this will suffice whatever is there in the trading view default uh, template that will suffice so now we created our boards so i'm just complete this so I will not take this example because I've already set up this one here. Um, maybe I will do this. Um, so demo signal part. So what I do is I'll create a webhook interface here, right? So um, I'll, I'll not I'll, I'll create alert here. Um, so this is the strategy which, I, which is still on, 
and then go to create alert <coughs> on the strategy. So, so what I do or say strategy and the alert name is demo bot alert. Okay, so before setting the alert or before um, creating the web host, one thing we need to make sure um, is that you're using a right um, symbol. For example, right now what I'm using is BTC USDT Perpetual uh, and it's the OKX exchange. You need to make sure that you're using the right symbol. So if you use some other exchange symbol, then you'll get you'll, that auto trading will not work. You'll get an error, right? So uh, also, um, okay, that's let's look at that later. So <clears throat> the next thing is uh, you need to also manage your uh, um, manage your account uh, capital and other things here. Like what is the order size you want to uh, execute and all? You need to set it here properly. So if you are trading with uh, two hundred dollars, make sure that you set initial capital two hundred dollars and the order size, uh, whatever the uh, you know order size you are planning to trade and all these things right um so the trading views alerts generated from here depend directly on this what is the quantity you're going to um you know um yeah you're going to trade at all these things it directly depends on this make sure that you set this properly and make sure that your account has this kind of a, a money to do the trading right so i've set these both of these things now i'll create the alerts <clears throat> okay so create alert rsa strategy and this is a demo alert right so now what i need to do this message instead of this message what i will do is i will use the message which is um, given by the signal bot okay so i'll say go to settings again so this is the message which is which they have given trading view um, um a strategy message so just copy this and paste it here Okay, so that's that's it. Like you know, we have set up our bot, but one more thing we need to do is we need to enable web OKR. So I've select this option. The others can stay as is; it's not a problem. Uh, it's not required as well. So select this option, web URL, and um, you have this code here. Uh, we have this URL here. Just copy this URL and then post it here, right? And then create so we have created an alert now demo alert for bot now you have created an alert from here it means that signal will flow from trading view to okx exchange so what happens then like you know we are not mentioned like uh, whether to trade or not we just created a signal here but in order to perform the trading what we also need to do is we need to create bot like you know you look at this what you do is you press on create bot and what all trading pace you are going to allow this um, bot to be like right now um, this signal is uh, generated based on BTC USDT perpetual so I'm just selecting this you can also select multiple um, combinations here so it means that allow trading auto trading on all these things right so exactly whatever it is so alert trading on all these things maybe select all um, then press ok so it means that it has created, um, uh, yeah, and you need to create also add a investment margin here. Um, maybe you need to select the same thing as what you have selected here. For example, it's 200, 10% of equity, right? So we'll do the same. It's a 200. 10% of equity and selecting the leverage you need to be really careful so you're using 10% of equity right so um, if you select multi the leverage what happens is um, if the stop distance is too much it will it may probably blow out your exchange you know um, blow out your balance so it's safer option uh, and unless you understand um, the leverage and other things safer option is to go with the 1x so I'll select the 1x here and then confirm um 200 and just yeah advanced settings yeah there's the thing as cream signal entry signal all these things that's okay do not change um and then create demo so confirm and our bot is uh must be greater than what is that sorry some error um, the order amount must be greater than 783 i'm not sure why is that 
uh, maybe I do not, I don't need to select all these things. Maybe I'll just remove all these things. Select trading uh, Just use this one for now. Let's see. Yeah, this is working okay. So BTCP, USDT. So let's set up the bot. Okay, so what happens now is whenever a signal is generated, you will keep uh, auto trading. For example, I cannot uh, wait for a new signal to come because it's going to take time. So what I'll do is I'll um, use the existing um, you know, bot and signal created to demo um, what is what's happening, what happens when you receive the signals. So you go to details here <clears throat> and you can see that the trades are generated and um, orders are completed, profits and losses are logged and all these things. Right, so you can see all those things happening here. How the you can also see how your tram bot is performing and other things, right? Um, so uh, yeah, that's uh, that's what you will do based on your alert. It will also generate um, signals and it will also generate the trades. You can see that if you if you look at the um, timings from the alert, uh, for example, I'll um, I look at this RSI uh, OKX signals here, right? So you can see that this is 125 and uh, this is 407 um, the time of the execution and you can see that uh, the same can be found here as well uh, i think it's too much yeah there are lots lots of them here a lot of signals have been generated uh, yeah 125 407 550 so there are a lot of signals have been generated here so you can see that the execution time is almost same as um, the alert time so there's very minimal latency here that's a, that's a very good thing and also if you use something like um, third party integration for example i created um, i actually um, you know made another video some time ago on how to create auto trading uh, but for zero cost uh, this uses pipe dream as an intermediate um, you know webhook generator or webhook uh, interface so in such cases or if you even if you use <clears throat> things like you know third party tools such as three commas uh, the problem there will be that um, you will um, uh, there will be another hop there like you know you need to uh, you need to send your signals to three commas a third party system and that will in turn send it to exchange so there's another hop there one extra hop that will add latency latency to your trade so there will be a time difference between um, the signal generation and the order execution so with this direct integration you know that can be uh, mitigated so that's one of the advantages um, of using the direct integration to exchanges um, but the problem is that you know these exchanges are very limited to the particular uh, these integrations are very limited to that particular exchanges so if you have multiple exchanges if you want to trade multiple um, you know uh, kind of instruments this will not be um, really helpful um, and another pro of um, of this is like you know um, it's very simple. Uh, you don't have to code anything. Um, the exchange will do the OKX does everything here. For example, it will provide you the signal. It will provide you the um, bar, uh, the trade webhook um, um, templates and webhook uh, um, the URLs and everything. Just have to uh, click few buttons and then uh, use that in your alert templates. So in that way, um, it's it's very easy for non-coders to set up a bot and do the auto trading. And also is you can save cost on third parties because third parties will come up with their own cost, maybe around 25 to 30 per month or more, even more than that. Uh, you can avoid all those costs um, by using this direct integration. So um, what is not like, you know, the cons is here, like um, um, the no native support for stop limit orders. So um, right now, the support is only for enter long, enter long, uh, exit long, enter short, and exit short. So all these are market orders. There is no limit orders, stop orders. That's one of the, um, the drawback of this. Uh, but if you are plugging into strategy engine, um, it actually executes very seamless. Um, even though you know in your strategy you can set your stop and limit, and based on that um, the stop limit, it will trigger the order and it will it will have it will have some um, you know a market order, but still. Um, you know, you can make it work in your strategy as a stop order, right? So, and no, no support for bracket orders are come kind of pre-planned orders. That's another uh, cons of this. So, for example, um, 
I've received a lot of requests where um, you do trading, you do, you do auto trading setups such as um, when you when you find your setup, you set up your entry price, exit price, uh, and take profit multiple levels of take profit prices and everything, and uh, set it up in your bot, and it will automatically generate the trades based on that. So that kind of option is not available here. So um, I hope OKX will build on this and uh, uh, you know enhance this feature further more um, in future days. Okay, um, I think uh, that's all from today. Um, you know, this is a simple example um, and if you have a strategy which you are uh, regularly using it's very easy to set up an auto trading bot and sleep without worrying about you know um, being um, being liquidated or being stopped out um, and all okay um, that's all from today thanks very much for listening please let me know if you have any questions um, enjoy thanks